Hello, my name is Justin Kirkwood, and I'm going to introduce you to the LifeBot telemedicine system. We'll hook up some peripherals to the vital signs monitor, make a call to a physician, and review some of the system's advanced features. The LifeBot system is currently running on battery power. We're going to launch the main interface. Then we select the appropriate user profile and log in. And now it's time to connect to some of our peripherals so we can take our vital signs prior to calling a physician. I'll slip on the blood pressure cuff and the SpO2 sensor. And I'll just hold on to the temperature probe. As you'll see, the visualizations begin to populate. Now I'll take my blood pressure. And now it's time to make a call to a physician. The physician will receive an incoming call from my system. When the call is accepted, the video link is established. The physician will immediately see the vital signs of the patient as well as the patient's video. In this case, the patient has a swollen gland in the throat. The doctor is asked to take a closer look. The main webcam can be removed from its magnetic mount to provide close-ups of areas of interest. The patient's verbal reporting, combined with the video, vital signs, and paramedic observations, allow the doctor to make a diagnosis from afar. The LifeBot system also allows for the paramedic to enter information relevant to a diagnosis, such as medical history and current medications. If we had connected an ECG, we could also see those biosignatures in the interface. Other standard peripherals like end tidal CO2 sensor and ultrasound are also available. There are many other data capture modules in the software that collect information about the current call, including trauma reports, advanced care reports, patient billing, and release forms. The software also features an array of medical scoring indices and calculators to assist the paramedics during the call. The LifeBot contains a ruggedized computer meant to withstand rough handling on the go. The communication system of the LifeBot includes automatic failover protection using multiple redundant protocols to maximize the robustness of the connection. The system features dual 4G LTE and 3G SIM cards for data coverage and overage prevention. It also includes external Wi-Fi and GPS antennas. This has been a broad overview of the main features of the LifeBot telemedicine system. For more information or for brochures and quotes, you can email us at info at lifebot.us.